So our logs are still there. And there's no cops around. There's no one around actually, which is uh, great. No one's gonna be giving me weird stares. So yeah. Hello everyone. This is uh, episode two of the volleyball net journey. So we're out here, we brought all the tools, and today we are going to mine the hole. So I'm gonna show you the tools. I'm gonna use the pickaxe and this massive metal rod. And just mine like that. I already made a small hole. Um, yeah, we're gonna have to expand it. And after that, we're gonna put both of the pieces of wood up, hopefully permanently this time. And then we're gonna try and see if we can buy some cement or something to fill the hole with. Since I've already made a little hole, I'm gonna try to shape it with a nail a little bit. Now, I don't know anything about tools, by the way. I'm just like, you know, learning. <laughs> sand inside is splashing into my eyeglasses and probably probably have a lot of scratches on them right now because of this and the other hole but they're bad sunglasses anyways not sunglasses glasses just glasses this is like a lat try workout honestly this is like a back workout because when I'm pulling down like this it's like I'm pulling the my back. It's very tiring. Never knew there was cardio for the back. Yeah. All right, so we have a couple problems. The first one is that my hands are being torn very badly, especially my right hand. So if you can see there, that's getting kind of bad. And yeah, so. That's an issue, I need to be wearing gloves. The second issue is that um, I did dig pretty deep, but honestly I didn't get deep enough for now. Um, the second issue is that they are not aligned, the holes are not aligned. So there is a difference of about like 70 centimeters. And what we're gonna do about that is that we're probably gonna have to angle the whole court a little bit. So it's not gonna be like straight ahead. It's gonna be like angled a little bit to the left. It's not a huge difference. Because it's a long distance, it's probably like gonna be 10 degrees or something like that. So it's not gonna be noticeable once I hang the net. But when I line up the logs like this, it's pretty clear. The nice thing about this tool that I borrowed is that it has uh, two ends. One of them is pointy, which can be used for like destroying rocks and anything that's like stuck. And then there's this flat end, which can be used to like make space and stuff so yeah it's pretty great so as you can see the wood is not staying upright because the hole I accidentally expanded too much and it's not shaped I need to like shape it on the inside let me show you guys don't think it's very visible 
Yeah, so it's like not shaped at all. It needs shaping. It needs to look like the piece of wood right there. At least like a little bit so that, you know, it holds it. So yeah, I'm gonna try to do that. All right guys, so the afternoon is fully here. You heard the prayer, the afternoon prayer. That means the sun is gonna kill me and it's my sign to stop working for now. So I'm gonna show you the latest progress, right? Um, I marked the logs, right? So here it says net 2.45. This is where the net is supposed to be for men. This is where it's supposed to be for women and this is where it's supposed to be for kids. Obviously, um, this like, I, I just put it for a later reference. We can play wherever we want. And since we're beginners, we're probably gonna be playing somewhere around here. This is, by the way, like Olympic type beat stuff, but we can play here as well. I marked an extra five centimeters, 10, 15 for later. I'm probably gonna saw the rest of the log off. Probably at the 10 centimeter mark. And I did the same on the other log. And I fully dug the hole. It's good now. I only need to install the logs and put some, some to hold it. So I'm gonna look into that and what I can put. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today's work. Whew. Today was very hard. I was digging for almost two hours, I think. But we finally got the hole done. We got everything pretty much. The hardest parts are done. We just need to install now the things. Probably gonna be returning all or most of the tools to my friend, except for the saw because I didn't saw anything yet. We should be able to start playing in a day or two, hopefully, max. So yeah, stay tuned for that. See you guys later.